And news from the tech world, not a good one this time, where Apple is likely to cut down production of its iPhone 13 by as many as 10 million units due to global chip shortage. Reports say the company is expected to produce 90 million units of new iPhone models by end of this year and company has told its manufacturers and component makers that number of units would be lower because chip suppliers including Broadcom and Texas Instruments are struggling to deliver components. In July, Apple forecast slowing revenue growth and said chip shortage which had started hitting ability to sell Macs and iPads would also crimp iPhone production. Texas Instruments also gave a soft revenue outlook hinting on chip supply concerns for rest of the year. Chip crunch has put immense pressure on industries ranging from automobiles to electronics leading many automakers to temporarily suspend production. With its massive purchasing power and long-term supply agreements with chip vendors, Apple has weathered supply crunch better than many other nations, leading some analysts to forecast that iPhone 13 models released in September would have a strong sales year as consumers looked to upgrade devices. We on now available in your country. Download the app and get all the news on the move.